sure going to be a great movie. These space war movies are starting to bore me. They're all the same. You'll like this one. They've got a bunch of great special effects. Come on, I want to get good seats. <laughs> All right, Mayhem, let's get this show on the road. I'll give them an opening night to remember. Go get them! Yeah! I told you the special effects were terrific. Terrific? It all looks fake to me. There, ready for action. That was a good one. I could almost feel it. Huh? Feel what? Then, these are the best special effects I've ever seen. The roof's still intact. All right, Rex, you try it. My pleasure. Dagger, your turn. I'll give him everything I've got. On target. Yeah! This is great. It's so real. Yes, too real. Hey, this isn't part of the film. Uh, I sure hope it's not the coming attraction. Come on, let's get outside. Ben. What are they doing here? Dad, look! <laughs> I always did want to break into the movies. Retreat. But I was just getting started. I said retreat. Our objective was accomplished. Why would Venom go to all that trouble just to ruin a movie? That's what I'm going to find out. What are you going to do, Dad? Call in the mass team? Are you, huh? That depends on what information the computer comes up with. Well, you can count on us to help you get to the bottom of it. Is there somebody else here? I don't see. Sorry, Scott, but it's too dangerous. But T-Bob and I could... You'll have to stay behind. Hi, Matt. What's uh, going on? Mayhem's causing trouble again. I have to check the computer. How about if you and T-Bob went to the park? Or the library? But where am I gonna find action and adventure in a library? Under A in the card catalog. <laughs> I just don't want you to get hurt. Okay. Buddy, I'll be needing you. What a bummer. I can't help mask. And on top of that, Venom ruined the movie. Oh, the movie wasn't that good anyway. But I love space films. You know how interested I am in outer space. So why don't you go up to the observatory? They opened a new exhibit on the solar system. It did? Wow! Come on, let's go, T-Bob. Motor scooter mode. Okay! <laughs> It doesn't make sense, buddy. Why would Venom want to attack a movie theater? Well, let's see what the computer came up with. Analysis unsuccessful. Insufficient data. I could have come up with that. Select the appropriate mask agents for this mission. Selection complete. Recommended personnel. Gloria Baker, champion race driver, black belt in kung fu. Vehicle code name, Shark. Brad Turner, expert motorcycle and helicopter pilot. Vehicle code name, Condor. <laughs> Alex Sector, computer and communications expert. Vehicle code name, Rhino. Buddy Hawks, intelligence expert. Contact with the underworld. Vehicle code name, Firecracker. Personnel approved. Assemble Mobile Armored Strike Command. 
So that's all the computer could come up with. Not much at all. One thing's for sure. Venom had more in mind than stopping that movie premiere. Buddy, any luck with your underworld contacts? Yeah, my source says Venom's next strike is going to be the McKenzie Observatory. The Observatory? Scott and T-Bob are there. See that little green planet? That's Earth. Gee, it's so small. And what's that tiny purple planet way in the corner? <laughs> That's no planet. That's some kid's jelly bean. <laughs> Just in time, look what's polluting the sky. Everyone, into defense mode. <laughs> Here they come, into my trap. All I had to do was think that the observatory would be our next attack site. Rhino, Firecracker, Shark, give me ground support. Bass, you're in for the surprise of your life. Sonic Boom should shake up Mayhem. It won't fire. What's wrong? They won't get past us! I say, the battering ram should plow through those blokes! Hello? The battering ram stall! My belly cannons aren't working either! The power stroke won't deploy! My hypno headlights fizzled! What gives? None of my weapons are working either! Time to do a little can opening! Hey, Bob, you look weird. Hey, Bob, come back. Now what's wrong? Chicken might scare him. Nothing's working. I can't steer. Same here. My controls are locked. I'm stalling. <laughs> it worked. tried to steer clear, but I couldn't. It doesn't look good. Has there been any change at all? I'm afraid her condition is still critical. She's been unconscious all night. It was all my fault. I'll never forgive myself. Stop blaming yourself. You couldn't help it. Somehow Venom sabotaged our vehicles. 
Matt, would it be all right if I stayed here? Gloria might need me. Sure, Brad. And don't worry. We'll make Venom pay for this. Hey, T-Bob. Looks like you're back to normal. He sure is. Oh, I can't figure out what happened yesterday. T-Bob was affected the same way the masked vehicles were. What do you mean? According to the data readout of yesterday's battle, Venom has perfected a cyclonic disruptor. What's a cyclonic disruptor? It would be capable of interfering with our vehicle's operating system. The police located the telescope. Venom dumped it on a back road. They did? Then why did they go to all that trouble to steal it in the first place? It was merely a dress rehearsal for another, more important theft. Well, the computer is in agreement with you, Alex. Take a look at this. Hey, that's the movie theater. Now look at the observatory. Notice any similarities? Yeah, they both have those funny-looking domes. I say, Venom must have been using them as a trial run for whatever mission they're planning. I've asked the computer to come up with Venom's next logical attack. We should get the results soon. Well, wherever it is, we'll be ready. I've developed a counter-weapon which should neutralize the effects of the cyclonic disruptor. We spent all night installing them in the vehicles. I knew I could count on you guys. I even fixed a special unit for you, T-Bob. Oh, you shouldn't have. It plugs right in here. <laughs> Careful, you're tickling me. T-Bob is going to play an important part next time we come up against Venom. He is? Oh, boy. Oh, no. Alex explained what he wanted to do this morning, and I agree to it. If it's all right with you, T-Bob. T-Bob will be thrilled to help. I made T-Bob's unit extra sensitive. He will serve as our early warning system. You're riding Rhino with T-Bob, so you can let Alex know as soon as T-Bob feels the effect of the cyclonic disruptor. Wow! This is terrific! T-Bob, we get to help out! Oh, I'm underwhelmed. Dad, I promise we'll do a real good job. I'll show Venom a thing or two. Hold it, Scott. I told Alex the only way I would let you come along is if you stay in Rhino's computer room. But... It's the safest place of all the mask vehicles. And I don't want you leaving it for any reason, okay? Yeah, I promise. Hey, the computer's got something for us. Analysis of probable location of Venom's next attack completed. Based on Venom's overall objective, logical site is the Phelps Breeder Reactor. The Phelps Reactor? But it's not supposed to go into service until next month. They've only got a skeleton crew up there. And they've just received a big shipment of plutonium. Ah, the new Breeder Reactor. I think I'll give them a house warming. <laughs> Ready down there. You bet. Plutonium, here we come. Here come the party poopers. Well, I'll take care of them. Oh, no. T-Bob's acting nutty again. Activate his neutralizer. T-Bob. Everyone, activate your neutralizers! Check! Let them think we're out of control, but slowly work your way towards the reactor. Then give it to them. Cutting through a piece of cake. And it's my favorite flavor, plutonium. What happened? Rhino and Firecracker must have gotten out of the disruptor's race. I'll stop their interfering. I think those torpedoes need a lift out of light. Try 
tried to trick me. Well, they're not clever enough. I'll just increase the power on the cyclonic destructor. Oh no! Mayhem found a way to neutralize our neutralizers. Very unsporting of him, I must say. We'll have to abandon our vehicle <sighs> before they abandon us. Taking a rest, fast? <laughs> Rex, Dagger, get going! This is going to be so easy. Pull! Stiletto, fire! Whoa! Let's go! Everyone, gather around. Here's my game plan. Jackrabbit, on! Persistent fools. Well, I won't let them get... Do you see what I see? I do, and don't believe it. His plan will work as long as he stays out of the destructive range. These multiple holographic images ought to give me and a case of ice cream. Good show, Brad. Come on, we've got to stop Rax and Dagger. Something's wrong. The disruptor won't stop their vehicle. Break off the mission. We're too close to stop now. We're surrounded by mask agents. Get out of there, fast! But leave behind something for them to remember us by. You know what? There they go! Forget them. We have a bigger problem on our hands. Don't like the looks of this. Spectrum on. It's a time bomb. It's set to go off in 30 seconds. Standardized electronic firing mechanism, complete with fail-safe backup. What's that mean? It means if we try to open it up to defuse it, this whole place goes up like the 4th of July. That's it. If I can attach it to my rocket pack. Looks like Venom bombed out again. Sure you don't need my help, Gloria? Thanks, T-Bob, but I feel fine. You sure got well fast. I had no choice, Scott. After all, your father and the team were having all that fun with Venom. Fun? You call chasing Venom all over two counties and being nearly blown up fun? Yeah, I do. You know, she's right. <laughs> hey, look, Dad. Jam's hitchhiking. He'll get to the soccer field way before us. Maybe, but maybe not. Hitchhiking is dangerous. You never know who's going to pick you up. The person who picks him up could be a Venom agent. Or worse, a child molester. Hey, Jeff, how about walking to the game with us? Dad, when it comes to hitchhiking, I say thumbs down. <laughs> <laughs>